they un- this is from netflix.com they unveiled their first ever multi-title immersive shopping experience so let me explain October 13th, they invite you to kick off the holiday shopping season at Netflix at the Grove, an unforgettable immersive retail experience that brings fans of all ages closer to the series and films they love and know. One of the most iconic shopping entertainment tourist destinations is Los Angeles. The pop-up store will feature a broad range of limited edition items from some of Netflix's most popular titles, Stranger Things, Bridgerton, Squid Games, and more. Squid Games is oh, random. I saw the picture of Squid Games. No random um so that's kind of cool i mean so notable characters including vecna from stranger things the iconic young he doll from squid games and queen charlotte's throne and more i think bring back in-person shopping experiences because too seriously i miss that online it's not as fun i mean Mm -hmm. The internet is taking over the world. <laughs> yeah, like, I mean, the robots, the yeah. robots are, you know. Anyways, I, I'm not, I'm not serious, but I kind of am because, like, I just think going in person. There's something so fun about that. Like, I look at the shopping malls in our area, and they're just become like homeless centers. Like, there's no, you know, you used to go to the shopping mall when you were like young and. It was like where you did your first date at like a food court or something. And it, that was fun, you know? In person is fun. Normalize in person. I like going from like internet to in person. And I think that's a cool thing too. Cause like Amazon has been thinking about doing a warehouse. They've done like Amazon Fresh, they've done like actual grocery stores, which is really cool. Oh, I didn't know that. I think so. I think they're like warehouses where you can like go look at their Tupperware and like that kind of thing, <laughs> which that's where my mind is, right? The Tupperware. Well, you know what's interesting? If Amazon <clears throat> does start doing in-person stores like that, they literally are in control of us because we went from in-person to online because of Amazon. And then if we go from like in-person, from online to in-person, and it's because of Amazon. That's so crazy. Jeff Bezos, man, that that gentleman has quite a hold. I'm gonna be honest, he has quite a hold on me. I love me some Amazon. I wish I didn't, but I do. This dress, no, this is for Forever 21. But oh, actually, nothing I'm wearing is from Amazon. Oh, these mics are from Amazon. They they just are. I'm sorry, they are. Wait, I think that we have a. Yeah, like, look, Amazon Go. Use the Amazon app to open an entry gate and start shopping. Shop, pick up your items as you please. You can use your own bag or one of ours. Wait, and that's once you're, cool. When you're finished, you just walk through the exit gate. You will be charged for what you take. Is that in Charlotte? Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Oh, I was going to say, we should do, like, a vlog. That actually sounds really fun to try. Chicago, Illinois, it oh, says okay. is the closest one. Well, that's not Charlotte. Um, So back to what <laughs> you were saying about in person. Even, like, when I was thinking about when we would go um to the mall to look for, like, what are we going to wear for this? Or, like, when I, w- I was on a sorority for a year and all the parties were themed, you have to run to the mall. What, what am I going to wear? Like, that was fun. Yes. And you can get it immediately as opposed to Amazon. You know, you'd have to bet, like, pray that you get it in time. But it was right. fun to all, like, oh my goodness, I need a, I need sparkles. Where am I going to get sparkles? I, I know, know. But, like, I don't know where I would get sparkles today. Amazon. Right. But, like, in person, like a Hobby um, Lobby? Maybe. Oh, Maybe they have a limited selection. Bo- well, I'm th- if I'm thinking body sparkles, if I were to get body sparkles, I'd try Claire's. I would try Hot Topic, maybe? I don't even really like going to Hot Topic. <laughs> oh, gosh. Hot Topic. The well, there's so many benefits to, like, anyways, there are so many benefits to in-person, you know, shopping yeah. experiences. I think bring them back. I agree. I will say, so back to the story, I will say, I some I love the idea of, like, having, um like, a Bridgerton experience. I didn't watch the show, but I hear it's really good. Stranger Things. 
I love Stranger Things. I don't know if I like the idea of a Stranger Things experience. Stranger Things, I wouldn't say it's scary. It's anxiety inducing though. So I, I'm curious, like, you know, if Vecna's standing there over you, I, I don't know how like yeah. fun that would be. Like what is this all immersive experience and how far are we willing to go? Right. And even like the Squid Games thing, like that, I mean, <clears throat> I saw one episode. First of all, I was like, I'm not, everybody's talking about this. I do not want to watch this. My brother's like, watch it, watch it, watch it. It's usually how it happens. I watched it. I was hooked. I saw the whole thing through, I think in like two or three days. Loved it. Would I want to experience it? No. I don't think that was, I, you know, they're doing a reality series where you go through the squid games. Obviously you don't die, but like you go through all the games. Is that stupid? Yes. Is that something that any of us should want to do? I don't think so. Um, so I'm kind of interested in like, or I'm curious about how immersive these experiences are. Um, yes. Do they shoot you with like a BB gun or like when you like? Cause or you, do you just stand you, there? Right. Did you see Squid Games? No. Oh, no. so you don't even know the full. Okay. But you get the premise of Squid Games? Yeah, of course. Okay. So I'm like, is there so... I don't know. If there was a TV show or something that you could do an immersive... Did you ever watch Westworld? Mm Mm-mm. Okay. Let me explain Westworld real quick. Westworld is this show... I know, I know. It's a sci-fi show. I really think that everybody should try at least a couple episodes. It's where it takes place. So it's a sci-fi a show. So it's this theme park that you go to that is kind of like the it is the wild wild west. But there's like animatronics that are incredibly lifelike. Look up Westworld really quick. They're they look yeah. incredibly human. And you go in if you have enough money, you go in and you can say, Hey, I want to stop this guy from robbing a bank. So you go in and you're on the train and a guy comes around the bed and you like go through it. That actually seems wow. really fun. Except the people like mm-hmm. yeah, like they made them look so human. So that would be a little like uncanny valley because it's like ah, you because you yes. literally shoot someone and they bleed out, but um they they're animatronics, they're robots, so it's not real. And there's, like, so much to it. Anyway, so, like, what, if you could have an experience kind of like that for any TV show, what would it be? Oh, my gosh. I'd have to think. I don't think it would be something, like, too dramatic. I think it would be something fun. I think it would be, like, a candy land, you know? Okay. I've heard really good things about The Happy Place. Oh, my family likes that movie or that show. No, The Good Place. Yeah. The Good Place. The Good Place? Yeah, The Good Place. Oh, but you know what? You know what would also be really cool? I guess, and I don't, I don't want to be like this person, but like, when the chose, like the Chosen seems like a really cool time, mm-hmm. place to be. Just like as a fly on the wall, but I don't need, I don't want to like get too involved in the drama. Yeah. See, that's, there's some of them I agree with you about the nothing too dramatic. I love, like I said, I love Westworld. Mm-mm. Wouldn't want to be part of it. Love Stranger right. Things. Couldn't be a part of it. Um, Love the boys. Could not be a part of that. Oh, you know what? Um, Actually, I think Mamma Mia, because I love good music. I love good well, dancing and I love Grease. That would be fun. Yeah, those type of things that I would be. I'd love to be in Princess Diaries too. I'd love to be at the sleepover they have where they slide on the mattress down the. Oh, yes. Yes, 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 yes. yes. That 100%. Is, that's something I want to immerse in. I, you know, I love Doctor Who and the idea of like Doctor Who, like, what if, you know, you wake up and he's in your bedroom and everything and like you can go off with him. I want to say. Like, there's a part of me that's like, oh, yeah, that's going to be so fun. There's another part of me that's like, that is absolutely terrifying. Yeah. No. Like, there's times I think about this, too. Um, Someone pointed this out about, like, the Outer Banks kids. There's times where you have to run. 
I can't run. Like, I mean, I can run. Like, I physically can, but I, I can't run fast enough. Like, so why would you electively? <laughs> What'd you say? I said, so why would you electively run? Like, you can, but, like, why would someone exactly, choose to? Exactly. But in the Doctor Who world, you know, a dialect could be chasing me. So I'm, like, running. And, and like, I just can't. Yes. Like, when I think about that, I need to be something fun, chill, show community. I'd love to be at school with all of them, maybe join the study group. Like, I have to be something, like, low stakes, silly even. I, I can't do the yes. action and, like, you know, I'm, like, dumb and hiding. Do you think maybe we're taking this a little too seriously? No. It's, it's fun to think about. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's fun to think about, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> so let hmm. us know. Is there, like, a TV show or a movie you want to be, like, immersed in? You think it would be fun to join? You want to join Totally Spies? You want to be a part of Whoop? Did you watch Totally Spies? Is that before your time? No, that is before my time. Such a good show. It's coming back, everybody. Um, would you want to join Kim Possible? Kim Possible is not before your time, though. Mm. Did you watch Kim Possible? No, but I heard of it. Okay. I didn't watch <laughs> it, but I, I've definitely like seen it. Okay. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Kim Possible is a really, really good show. I hate you missed out on. Um, 